I believe the interface in Cinema 4D has been designed to work perfectly under any circumstances and in front of any user. However, there are times when you probably want to create your own interface and arrange it in a way that is going to help you work even better or faster. The first thing that I want to show you is that every single window inside Cinema 4D can be rearranged. If you take your mouse and position the mouse very close to the center or in between two windows, you can see that it changes from an arrow to a double arrow icon. When that double arrow icon happens, you can actually click and then start resizing and repositioning the preference of every single window. For example, you can change the priority or the size of one window over the other by just going and clicking away in this fashion. Another way to customize your workflow is by clicking on the change view icon and that icon if you go in the middle of those four windows you can actually change the priority or preference of what window do you want to have uh, more priority than the other. Also, you can go into the panel menu of any of these windows and select an arrangement of windows. Right now, we are in the four views, but then you can select two views stacked. Now you have the perspective view and the top view on the bottom. You can always change the preference of what type of view you have. For example, down below I have the top view, but maybe I want to change it to something else. So you go into that view, into cameras, and then you can choose perspective, parallel, left, right, front, back, top, or bottom. And for example, if you just want the right view, you just select it, and now you are looking at your scene from the right view. And then you have the preference of working in these two windows. As you can see, these two windows are a little too flat for my taste in here, so I can go ahead and go back to the panel arrangement, and instead of using the two views stacked, I can use the two views side by side, and I think that is a better proportion of whatever I want to try to do here. Now, if you want to go back to the four views, the standard views, just go ahead into the arrangement uh, options and select the four views once again, and now you are back to normal. If your work environment doesn't look exactly like the one I am having here, maybe it's because you already have a different layout. To go to get the standard layout, just go into this menu over here and select the standard layout and now your window should look something similar to mine. As I mentioned previously, most of the tools that you need to use are readily available right here, either by using the shortcut elements, like either by clicking the letter U in your keyboard to get the selection tools, or the letter N to select the shading modes, or even the letter V to get access to the menus that are actually under your mouse. And here you can find many of the menus that are already enabled somewhere in here along the top part of the actual menu of the application. 